Hello everyone, I'm the Mar Man, and welcome back to Train Simulator, where today we're going to do something as a, a little sequel, I guess you could call it. Um, who remembers this? Here's the jet train, here's the coaches, and um, a mile is 1,609 metres. This train is 1,609 metres long. Well, if you do, you're in for a treat, and if you don't, well, go and watch that video and then you'll still be in for a treat. Well, we may have done the one mile train, but we had to go one bigger. Two miles is 3,218 metres long. This train is 3,218 metres long. Look at this. This is crazy. And it's Network Southeast because I like Network Southeast. So, yeah, we're going to go from Oxford to Reading. Um... Because I tried doing it somewhere else and it didn't work, unfortunately. I don't know why. But we're going to do this once again because why the hell not? Let's get the brakes off. That, that, lights on and go. Come on. Oh, it helped if I put it into forwards. That would be really helpful indeed. We've got to try and make sure we don't wheel slip as well. That should be entertaining to try and do. So yeah, we're just going to take this thing from Oxford to Reading. And just well, eventually we'll do a, 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 a watch it all go past. And that's going to take quite a while. I want to build some speed up before then. But as you can tell, this train's um, bl bloody long. Um, yeah, I kind of wanted to do this for quite a while. But due to the quick drive not working, I wasn't able to. But with the, with the beta patch they released out, it works again. So I made this and I'm very happy that I did. The couplings are stretching quite a bit, aren't they? Oh dear, that aren't, that's not good at all. Uh, hopefully we'll be fine. Hopefully the couplings won't stretch themselves apart. And we should we should be fine. So yeah, every ten coaches there is a network southeast class forty seven. Original livery, I believe. So that's good. Yeah, um, network southeast crazy. Favourite livery. Um indeed. And yeah, this train's rather long. As you can imagine. Yeah, two miles is is a long, long train. Has this side even started moving yet? I'm assuming it has. Yeah, we're moving. That's good. We are motoring along. Yeah, look at those good old engines there. Triple seven, two hundred engines. Very nice indeed. Yeah, there is. Yeah, the filler content at the back just makes it the right size. And Annie and Clarabelle have been a great help, which is useful. Clarabelle is facing the wrong way, sadly, but whatever. Um, and then we've just got a little, a little sort of like wagon there just to fill fill out the gaps. Um, this is probably more coaches, uh, more Mark II coaches than Network Southeast ever owned, but I uh, will go with it anyway. I went with the, I went with this route because I know that most of it is like the track is dead flat, so I knew we'd be okay. Um, anything that's got too sharp a turn or an incline is a really bad idea, because reasons. So we're at six percent throttle right now, and we're we're going along rather well, ish. We just need to get a little bit more throttle up, but we've done a wheel slip if if possible. Is there anything between 6 and 13? No. Okay. Yeah, we'll just have to improvise. We won't watch the whole train go past yet. Because it it's going to take a little while. It did last time. Um, and this train's twice as long. So, yeah. But it's just very nice. We're back with the jet train. Um, I don't know what else to do with the jet train, really. Apart from... Because it's, it's, it's one of the easiest trains to crash. You just full throttle and crash. It's easy. Um full throttle on this and we'll just grind to a halt because this train must weigh a lot well if you think about it think about how much that metal frame would weigh which is a certain weight you've got two sets of bogies you've got an, an aircraft engine and that's times two because one at the back you've got however many mark um mark two coaches plus numerous class 47s this train is very heavy um needless to say and yeah, Reading's in 25 miles. We should make it. Oh god, the, yeah, the frame rate's going to be a bit more do more dodgy in particular on this one because, well, of this lot. Yeah, that lot. Yeah, that's that's a long ass train, isn't it? Yeah, you wouldn't argue with this, would you? I mean, obviously, if you if you're standing on the tracks, go back to the front. Oh god, right. Come on, game. If you were standing in front of this train, you would get hit by the front, probably have your feet chopped off, um, you get thrown into the Stig's face, 
get sucked into the jet engine and um, grinded up into smithereens, and then your body parts will bounce across hundreds of coaches and then get blasted by another jet engine. So don't do that in life. Don't do that. So yeah, we're actually going rather quick now, aren't we? Once we get to 50 miles an hour, I guess we can try and watch the train go past. Let's put a bit more throttle and see what happens. Oh, there we go. Look at that. We're motoring now. Yeah, go on. Top speed ahead. 90 miles an hour. Let's do this thing. Yeah, let's rewatch the train go past at some point in the near future. Yeah, let's do that thing. Right, let's go and stand over... Oh, God, which way are we going? Please tell me we're going straight on. Yeah, we're going straight on. Okay. Well, we can watch from here, can't we? Um... I won't count. I'll let you guys count. Because um, I'm not crazy. Um, trying to, If I try counting like this at the moment, I'd probably lose my breath and die. Because I'd have to count out loud. It's kind of pointless for me to count in my head. Um, so you guys can count how many coaches there are. Because I lost count. Um, it's probably quite a few. Indeed. So yeah, we're just going to watch this train go past now. It could take quite a while. But it is very awesome indeed. And I went with, I just, like I said, I went with Network Southeast because I, um, I really enjoy Network Southeast. You can probably tell if you look at my thumbnails or you look at my YouTube banner, um, my Twitter um, cover thing, you probably know I like Network Southeast. Um, if you know what those colours mean to me, Network Southeast. Because it's a very nice livery and it's, it's, you know, the childhood livery of me. It's what I saw in when I was very young, so it stuck in my mind. So that's the thing. So yeah, we're just going to watch this train go past, uh, just watch it go past now. It could take a little while. Uh, this is awkward. This is really awkward. <laughs> just waiting for a whole train to go past. La la la. Goodbye, Class 47s. Have fun in your life. Um, I'll catch up with you at some point in the future. Yeah, what's your, cause with these trains, I mean, it's like, this is, this is the commuter service of the future, isn't it, really? It's like a really long train. It really is indeed. I wonder how long, what the longest train in the world is. I wonder if I could try and make it in here on train sim. Obviously, there is the problem of if you make if you make a train too long, especially on my laptop, um, I'll run out of memory and the whole sim will crash. So I'll try my best to make as long as train as possible. But this does take um, quite a long time to load, as you can imagine. Just this. Well, at least the coaches seem to be all stuck together again now, so that, that's good. How fast are we going? Ah, 62 miles an hour. So we are still steadily increasing our speed. That's that's good to know. Um, I don't. If we make line speed, that'll be good. Then we don't want to speed too much, because the, the, I'm sure the crash in this thing would be a colossal frame rate horribleness, as you can quite well imagine. So yeah, I don't think this would be possible without the jet train. It's the only thing that's got enough oomph to pull this. Um, if you, I don't think the class 47s or any train could do this length. So you'd need to make the jet train in real life, which I'm sure is possible in some way. So yeah, I'm just glad to have revived this, because I, I, I love the jet train. And oh my god, are we near the end? There's some invisible coaches, what's going on? Why is the train not loaded? Okay, right, so the coach, right, so the train gets out of rendering distance. Yeah, so the train got out of rendering, so it's impossible to watch this whole train go past because it rent it, you know, unrenders thing. That's really weird. Okie dokie. Well, we're doing well. We're doing well indeed. How far have we gone? Um, a few miles so far. There's a station coming. Yep, we're going 70 miles an hour. Look at this. Could you imagine being on a, on this platform and just being sort of like it's like you know. Oh my god, that's quite the train, isn't it? Wow. I just wish we could watch the whole thing, but it doesn't stay in rendering distance. Um, low settings for the win. I could probably do that in the future. Um, yeah. The future. Let's talk about the future, shall we? I've been reading a lot of forums um, about like the next version of Train Sim, like the new engine one. And I'm probably not going to upgrade to it straight away because there's a good chance I will lose all the DLC that I've bought until it's upgraded and then there'll, there'll be some sort of upgrade fee and I'm not waiting for them to do that, you know, and having barely any roots. It would have to be amazingly amazing for me to want to upgrade it 
um, you know, with like my favourite route in it, that's like a billion times amazing for me to want to do that. So yeah, we'll see how that goes. But as it stands at the moment, I don't think I'm going to be um, upgrading when when it releases. Um, I don't even know what it's going to be released yet. They haven't said anything. Do we do? Oh my god, this train is crazy. This train is crazy indeed. Yeah, if I tried doing three miles, um, it wouldn't even load properly, would it? Because it, you know, most of the train would start it would be out of rendering distance. That wouldn't be good. Um, so how far have I got to go down for the train to be in rendering distance? Because then it doesn't render. Because then it doesn't render properly, and you don't see it until it's too late. Ah, here we go. So yeah, there's the end of the train. It's not too bad. Hello. Annie and Clarabelle and a thing and the jet train. So yeah, right. Now we've got to try and get to the front of the train. So um, let's do this thing. Front of the train, front of the train, front of the train. Front of the train, front of the train, front of the train. Why am I doing this in some sort of chant? I don't even know. <laughs> what, what, am I, what is my brain even doing? Go, go, camera. Go, go, camera. I'm just singing my way to the front. Yeah. Oh dear. Right, we're nearly there. That is endless streams of birds in the sky. Come on. Oh my god, this train is huge. Right. Should I try and count the coaches in a minute? Is that like a really bad idea that I'm going to try anyway? Probably. Right, we've made it. We've made it. We've made it. Right, how, how fast are we going? Oh, nearly 80 miles an hour. Um, the train is... A quarter of the train has gone through that station. Um, that's good to know. Okie dokie. Yeah. Let's hope that the speed limit stays at 90 for the foreseeable future, shall we? In fact, let's have a look at the map. Stop at Reading. There's us. And that's how long our train is. Oh my god, that's crazy. It makes you wonder that when that... Um... When the thing says we're going to be two miles away from Reading, the back of the train is still going to be four miles away from Reading. That's just crazy. Um, let's hope Reading appreciate the train I'm going to be giving them today. Hopefully I won't do it in much fire explosion and death like I keep doing in, the, in, in trains. That's not fun. We're going through two stations at once. That's pretty cool. That's very cool indeed. There's a track coming off from the side. Where do you go? No, 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 no. Oh my, hang on, wrong, wrong button. I wanted to see, could you imagine? Oh my god, I'm really late for work. I need to go past, like, now. And you just look down, it's just sort of like, I need to get to work. Oh, hello, flash. Hang on, I can make those float. Oh my god, the floaty lights of noisiness. Yeah, I wouldn't want to be waiting for work with this train going past, would you? No. Yeah, let's leave that beepy noise of annoyingness away. Good luck at getting to work. Sorry. Sorry that my train's really long. It's going to take a good couple of minutes. Why is the signal yellow? Why is the signal yellow? I don't know. We're nearly at line speed. That's amazing. On 13% throttle, we've made line speed. Why does that say 70? Oh, dear. We're now speeding. Um, throttle off. Throttle off. Oh, no. We can't throttle off because we'll lose too much speed too quickly. We're too heavy. Oh dear, we can only increase speed from now on. No wonder I didn't see the 70. The train's so long, the front of the train doesn't fit. Oh dear. Okay, well we know we know now that speed limits are a thing I'm just going to have to deal with on the fly. Um, which should be entertaining. Um, we're turning off. Yeah, we're going to throttle down. We're going to throttle down. Because I don't know which way we're going. Hang on, which way are we going? Uh, where are we going? That that was a that was a green thing to say that we're oh no we're doing that we're, we're we're doing this this can't be good for anybody involved oh dear train please be okay oh dear this because it doesn't look like a tight turn but in the jet train anything's a tight turn oh look at that snaking that's pretty cool that's very cool indeed that we could be here a while. I kind of, I can't put the throttle on now until the whole train's really gone past there, because if I go too fast going around this bend, 
and this changing tracks. If one thing derails, it'll derail the whole thing. It's like with the old toy trains used to get. Does anybody rem remember Tomica trains? If you do, you're a legend. If you put made like a really long train that went around a corner too fast, if one coach fell off, it pulled the whole train off. Um, so we can't. That's I'm, I'm applying the same logic. I'm applying toy train logic to the world's longest train or the UK's longest train. Because the UK's longest train is half a mile long, and it's the ballast replacer train. There you go. That's another fact. The only other train that's half a mile long in in the UK is the Euro Shuttle, the one that carries their lorries and cars and stuff. They're half a mile long, but technically they're French. They're not. Tr they're not truly British trains. They don't count as being the longest train. Oh well. Oh my God. This is crazy long. This is just ridiculous. Where's the end of the train? It's like somewhere down there. Oh my God. That's just crazy. It's just snaking for days. Anybody want to end the train anytime you like? This is just ridiculous. I love it. It's fantastic. This this is what this is why this simulator is fantastic. It allows for this to happen. You know, if you had if you made like a really serious simulator, it wouldn't allow this. I'm so glad you can create your own consists. Oh god, every time you see a class 47 and one coach after it, you know there's another lot coming after it. I think the end of the train's coming up. Yeah, there it is. Boom. I should try to I should try and start counting it at some point. Let's get that back on, and then we'll go to the front of the train. My computer's trying to load something, that's weird. Oh, we finally got past it all. We're all, we're back, right, we're onto that line finally. We're onto that line. If the speed limit increases, we're going to have to wait two miles for the speed limit to actually go up. That could be entertaining to try and not do. Right, let's put a bit more throttle on again, just so we've got the speed going up. Let's look at our um, future, future endeavours of what's going to happen. Tracks related stuff, tracks related stuff, tracks related stuff. Okie dokie. Should we try and count the coaches? I Last time I tried counting the coaches on a really long train, it went horribly wrong. Because I, I got to 77 and then said 88. But considering my brain, that's not really surprising. So we'll just look at this with a lo lovely cottage in the background. Here we go. Oh my god, I screwed it up. No, 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 I screwed it up. Oh my god, I just slipped over my tongue and completely screwed that up. Well, it's lots of coaches, isn't it? Yeah, I screwed that up completely. Oh dear. My brain just went, ugh, and I screwed it up. Why is my train slowing down? More throttle, please. We can go 125. If I can get to 125, then I'll start counting. I got to, like... 69 and then my brain went all oh, 59 or something my brain just went Fleh, and I completely screwed that up oh dear right we'll either try we're going to try it two times here we'll either try it 10 miles left to go or uh, 125 miles an hour which I highly doubt we're going to get to we'll try though more throttle wow we're not actually um, we're not actually wheel slipping that's impressive Good. We'll just keep increasing the throttle then so we can get to line speed. And then I'll try and count it. How much throttle is going to be too much? That's going to be too much. Right. Anything between 20 and 30 is what we need to know. 26. Is that good? Oh, yeah. Here we go. Here we go. Do we have passenger view? Do we have... No, we don't have passenger view. Right. Our speed limit's now gone down to 120. Okay. I can deal with 120. Right, and then I'm going to try and count it again. Because um, what happened was I lost my breath, and then my brain died, and then stuff went wrong, and I, I slipped over my words, and then my, I forgot what I was doing. So, that's not good. That's it. Come on, full speed this. No, come on. I want to get to about 100 miles an hour. No, can't do, can't do 40. Travis, if you start wheel slipping, you start slowing down. No. 33 it's going to have to be. Right, should we try and count again? Should we try and count again? This is going to go so horribly wrong. And my train will probably derail in the process and we'll never get to count. Right, okie dokie. 
Let's get ready for this, mole man. Let's do this thing. It's speeding up too fast. I can't count that quickly. No. Oh, for God's sake. I can't count that quickly. Oh, we get, we're getting closer and closer every time. I got to the 70s. It's probably about 70. It's probably about 140. I've probably got about halfway through. The train's going too fast for me to count. Um, yeah, that's not good. Oh, well. Um, oh, well. I'll try and leave. I'll try and count it at some point in the future and leave a, leave a number below on the screen because I'm kind of like that, and I'll actually tell you how how many coaches long it is. Because um, I don't know if you've ever tried counting at 100 and 100 or 100 miles an hour. It's not fun because we're practically going 100 miles an hour. So that's not good. Oh dear. So I can't count this quickly. It's just not easy. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Yeah, that's not possible. Yeah, because once the numbers start getting longer and longer, it just gets more and more difficult. Going through a station. What station is this? I don't know. I don't know. I wonder how fast we can get this thing to go before Reading. And then we're not going to stop, are we? Um, that station was Goring and... Streetly 2 Goring and Streetly Okay, never heard of that place Oh god, the frame rate Okay Yeah, look at this Look at this awesome shot Awesome Yeah, this train went, if, if, if this gets Oculus Rift support And I get an Oculus Rift This will be amazing Come on, let's get to 100 miles an hour And then I'll try and get As fast as we can possibly go By just tapping the throttle until we get you know top speed acquired and then we can just like just, just full go it I, I should have done this all the way to Oxford but eh, I can always do that in another part but maybe not with a, the two mile long train we'll go from Reading to Oxford who knows who knows what we'll do for that I do like this line um, I haven't done any scenarios on it because I'm not very good at doing scenarios but this route's like really old isn't it it came up with the original um Rail works, so yeah, that's the thing. Come on, let's get to 100 miles an hour. 100 miles an hour. 100 miles an hour. 100 miles an hour. Come on, 0.3 miles now to go. 0.2 miles now to go. Come on, oh, I want to see that. I want to see that one double zero. I want to see that. I want to see that 100. Yes, show me that 100, and then we'll start trying to throttle it up. Yes, there we go. Right, 40% 40, 40 throttle. Trouble is, don't stop wheel slipping because that will cause major problems. Right, 46% throttle. As long as you don't wheel slip, it'll be fine. Oh, you can feel that acceleration. It's not really much more acceleration, is it, than normal? 53% throttle. Oh, we can hear the engine starting to kick into power mode. If that is even a thing, that's not really a thing, is it? No. Oh, this is crazy. This is absolutely crazy. Right, let's, um, should we watch the train go past again? Yeah, I think we should. Um, eight! Let's watch the train go past from this view here. Oh, so it's just awesome. This train is just amazing. Um, I recommend anybody to try and make it with any coaches you've got. And the jet train's free. Just Google Chris Train's jet train. Go onto his website, click download, and then click the... And just install, you know, install it, and then you're good to go. You're good to go. How fast are we going? 102. This thing's got to have a top speed. Um, but I want to try and beat that top speed. And go even faster than it. Come on, let's beat 102. Let's try and get to line speed. Before we're actually done here. Come on. Come on. We're not going any faster than 102. Why? 66% throttle. Come on, Class 47s. Work your diesel magic. Help me out here. I put lots of you in for a reason. I was going to do a whole convoy of just diesel trains, but with all this, with all the, the clag and the noises, it, it was horrible trying to do, trying to make that. Even like, you know, a quarter of a mile didn't work very well out of that one. Boom, come on. 
I want to see that throttle. I want to see that speed increase. Here we go. Got to 103 miles an hour. It's very difficult to do this now. It's just not going anymore. Oh, look, here's the end of the train. It doesn't take it just doesn't take too much longer to watch the train go past. Goodbye. Yep. The back of the yeah, yeah okay. Four miles away, or less than four miles away. I won't try to slow down. I don't think because um, there's not much point. Because about a hundredth of the train is going to be able to fit onto the platform. Um, well, not maybe maybe a, a, I don't know a twentieth of the train. I don't know. I don't know how many coaches are going to be able to fit. I do want to see this speed increase. Let's go on to the F. Um, F5, because then we can see, right, 104.4, 5, 6, yeah, it's going up, that's fine. Yeah, the speed is definitely increasing of much, much um, acceleration, this thing's. I don't want to see if I can get onto full throttle without wheel slipping. That'd be good. Come on, let's do this thing. Let's just, just full throttle it, and then we'll derail horribly. Two miles away, or three miles away, so yeah, it's 2.8 miles away. I know my maths. I know how that works. Please tell me we're not going that way. That's good. That's good. Right. Can I 100% throttle this yet? Without wheel slipping? That'd be good. Where was that? Tilehurst or Tealhurst? Tilehurst? I don't know. 100% throttle. Let's do this. This can't possibly go wrong. Right, I'm 100% throttling now and we're not wheel slipping. So what is whatever happens now, happens. That's a yellow signal. That's a flashing yellow signal. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Hang on. Flashing yellow means we're turning. Where are we turning and how badly? Oh no. Please tell me that's not for us. Please tell me this turn isn't for us. Oh no, that turn's not for us. Okay. What about this turn here? No. It definitely said there was a turn coming up. I'm sure we'll find out and it will we'll die horribly. Oh dear. Yeah, that's a flashing single yellow, unless of course it wants us to stop. In which case, if we, unless we are turning that way, this could really hurt in the next couple of seconds. Oh no, we're not going that way. Okay. Oh no, we're going that way. We're going to the left. Slide to the left. Slide to the left again, because that's where we're going. Oh dear. Is that us? Crap! Crap, crap! Oh, well that was an anticlimactic crash. Yeah, I told you, the train was so long I wouldn't be able to deal with that. Oh well. That's still, that was still pretty entertaining, wasn't it? We didn't make it as far as Reading. We got bloody close, though. Um, we did some wheel slippage, but we, we did 25 miles in that. So that was fun, wasn't it? The two-mile long train. Thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed it, then click like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next video.